Hey, well, welcome back everyone to Starbound. I have no idea how many people have seen like the story mode of this game. So I guess I'll show it off, but let's activate the gate. This is what I'm supposed to activate, right? Pick up this message, you have found an ancient gateway. Please use it and find me. You can power up the gate with the core fragments. Yes, ma'am. So we're going to the, what the hell is this thing called? I don't even know what the hell it's called. The outpost? I think it's called the outpost. I don't know. I've scanned core fragments nearby. They appear naturally with the geology of the planet. I don't know if this dude is talking about the stuff he's supposed to be talking about. Let's see what's, what, 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 what could we buy here? AA battery? Yes. Is that a cop? What you guys think? <laughs> no, we don't need any of that. I mean, I can sell stuff. Wait, let me sell my sword. Now I got this sword that I have, this one. Fuck this sword and fuck this ax, they both suck. There you go, get some, get some cash in our pockets. All right, so yeah, the story about this place has changed a lot though since I played the game. I don't know, a lot of stuff has changed since I played the game, if I'm being honest. But if we go all the way to the right, we run into a very important main character, I think. I'm pretty sure she's the main character because she was like the thing that started all of this, some shit like that. But let's just keep going to the right. It's going to get awfully silent. Kind of, not really. We take this, right? No. We keep going. We keep going. Yep, here we are. We're getting deep, deep into where we're supposed to be going. So, like, the whole story is we're supposed to fight, like, this tentacle monster. You know, the one that attacked at the beginning. Hey, what's up? I guess I just sit here and, and don't talk now. Wait, no, I do talk. Hello, dear. It's a matter manipulator you're carrying. Excellent. So, you're a protector. The last protector. Because everyone died. I'm, I'm sorry to say, perhaps the last. Oh, there you go. After the... The terrible destruction of Earth. R.I.P. Earth. It's sadly inevitable that we should meet now. People have wanted me to install more mods, but I'm not installing any more mods. I don't want to fuck up the pack. My name is Esther Bright, retired Grand Protector, or Esther Bright. Uh, I left some years ago, an impossible decision, but my research cannot be neglected. I discovered things long forgotten that weigh heavy on the present. I keep on blinking really hard. One of my eyes is like really dry. Long ago, there was a force known as the Cultivator. It maintained balance in the universe. Uh, under its influence, harmony reigned, so it was for aeons. But this tranquility provided finite, a being arose, one of hate and destruction, it was the ruin. The ruin could not abide life in any form and reap destruction upon the universe. It fought to blot out all life and would have succeeded but for the sacrifice of the cultivator. The cultivator rose against the ruin and succeeded in sealing it away. But in doing so, the cultivator exhausted its power completely. Before its last energies dissipated, the cultivator gifted six chosen races, races with precious artifacts. Ooh, I don't think my race is on that list, but, you know, we'll get it anyways. Uh, these six artifacts, when united, form the key that opens the gate to the ruin. Why would we want to open the gate to it? The defenses are crumbling. We must unite the artifacts, reach the ruin, and truly destroy it. Oh, that's why. Thanks for explaining. This is a lot to take in here and a huge request to make of you, but I would like your help. You're going to give me that sucks. <laughs> The artifacts are scattered across the stars. I can't find them alone. We must find them and eradicate the ruin before other planets go the way of Earth. There we go. That was a long ass talk. Thank you for joining me, dear. With your help, I know we can try. What's next? First things first, though. Dear, you need a ship in good working order. Who knows how far you'll have to travel before we're done. I think you should return to the outpost and speak to the penguin. Penguin Pete in the shipyard. The shipyard. I don't know how to fucking read if I'm being honest. I don't go to school. All right, let's talk to this guy. We're just going to start nabbing up quests now. I can repair the ship, but it's going to take 20 Urkius crystals. You better get yourself over to the Urkius mining facility. I've sent the location coordinates to your ship's sail. Thank you. So this is the quest where you fight the giant crystal. If you watch the uh, Terraria series, you know that one episode where we fought it. Anyone else got quests? What about you, mister? You got glasses? You're a penguin? Welcome, Dr. Akagi's Mech Workshop. I can assure you that this is a legitimate business. I trust them. I trust them. What about now here? You got a quest too? Is this Dreadwing? Uh, help me out, would you? Your business around here hasn't been so great since all my regulars are on the run from Dreadwing and his gang of crooks. Can you go and defeat Dreadwing for me? Come speak when you're ready and I'll send you right to him. Yeah, that quest is kind of easy, so I'm not just going to, you know, hop into that one. What about over here? Any more quests? We're just trying to get all the quests we can right now because... Oh, it's close because we want to do a bunch of quests you know get our gear up get our upgrades and stuff like that what is that thing maggot man says my thoughts are all pennies interesting i've been developing technology that will enable the user to swiftly dash from one point to another but i'm lacking a few crucial components from our prototype you should help me by bringing me 10 copper bars do i have 10 copper bars i do apparently 
You brought me the parts, wonderful, but these dash techs should be ready for action, but there's only a way to be sure. So you want us to test it, we're gonna test it for him. Excuse me, ma'am. Let's do it. So this is how we get all our like upgrades, our jumping upgrades, our dashing upgrades. There's more we get later on. I think it's like a bubble upgrade or some shit. Stuff like that. So what do I do here? Go this way. Look at the moves. How did they expect me to do that? <laughs> the first one was open for a long time. The second one literally just closed in one second. Come on, bro. This ain't even hard. This is the thing. Okay, there you go. We done did it. Oh, this part's easy, too. Um, Cut that part out where I said it was easy. Oh, my God. I got to go back now. The timing was weird, all right? I was expecting when it went away, I could dash through it, but it just kind of came back instantly. Oop. Oh, that one was close. Oh, my game kind of froze for a second. That almost fucked me up. We done did it. Easy, man. First try. Didn't fuck up anything. Sir, I am back. Dash tech appears to be functioning perfectly wonderful. Please keep the tech as token my thanks. I also have other prototypes that need testing, so come see me again when you're ready. I am ready. I don't know if I have the silver bars though. Yeah, I don't. So that, he gives us our double jump. That one. Any more quests? I don't think there is any more quests. This dash kind of sucks early game, if I'm being honest. Look at this. You don't really like slide, which which is what makes it weird. You kind of just like dash and stop. See that? Like, I don't like that. Hey, my little dipper lost his dear teddy bear. I just can't finish setting up shop with him like this. Can you help me get a new teddy bear for him? How the hell do you get a new teddy bear? Do you buy it? This is, uh, I have no idea how to do that. I think we have all the quests we can get, though. I think. I don't know. I'm not positive. I'm probably going to miss a couple of quests. Let, let me just check. Do you sell teddy bears? By any chance. Yeah, I fucking doubt it. All right, so this is what we need to do. We need to get our hands on a full armor set. Because this armor set is not going to cut it. I only have one piece of armor, for being honest. But yeah, I need to get my hands on a full armor set. So I'm going to head back to that planet. Go break more flowers. And then uh, I guess I'll meet back up with you guys. Because we got to do the Urkius Crystal Quest. What do we have here? <gasps> Mushroom people. He waved. What's up? How y'all doing? Knob Clink, come home. Shrop Shroom. Home Fessel, the Mushroom Habito. I love these guys already. Whom Fessel, the Mushroom Habito. <laughs> Whom Fessel, the... All right. So they're talking about their nice, beautiful mushroom house. Is that an egg up there? Y'all seen that, right? I know if you like take out a weapon, they get mad or some shit. I don't know. Let's not do that though. I like the mushroom people. Why would I want them to be angry? Ah! Oh damn! You got snipe. You gonna let them snipe you? Shit, you bitch! I see how it is. All right, let's beat this guy's ass for sniping the boys. So I'm out here looking for more plants and stuff to pick up. I wish this tree dropped petals. Not plants. Petals is what I'm looking for. I wish the trees dropped petals, but they just straight up don't. Uh oh. Oh, that's not good. What the fuck is that enemy? Just cover your head. <laughs> Careful here. That enemy is indeed hostile. Let's let's try and get to the roof. Are any of you guys merchants? That'd be really nice if any of them were merchants. Because that means I could possibly buy some of the mushrooms. Why is the cabinet on the roof? No, I won't question it. You know, quick nap in their bed. I hope you don't mind, ma'am. Just taking a nice little nap. You know, I'm missing a little bit of health. All right, what do you what do you have to offer? Nothing. Sweet. I'm not gonna kill them. They're mushroom people. They're some of my favorite themed characters in video games. Like, come on. My channel icon is based off of a mushroom from Minecraft. Like, come on. I love mushrooms. All right, so I ran through the whole entire planet, and I just can't get my hands on enough for anything. Look, I don't have enough for the chest plate. I almost have enough for the blue one. Or not the blue one for the skirt which is kind of whatever uh i just i guess we're just not gonna have armor i guess i mean what else can i do i went through the whole entire planet you know i did get my hands on i got my hands on this spear which does like zero damage i was gonna use it but like i said zero damage i don't know about it anymore let's, let's do can i oh when's if we do this put the uh throwing darts in this hand with the sword Ooh. We got the range and we got the melee. You know, get to test it out on him. But I guess we just have to do the Urkius Crystal with bad armor? Like, I don't know. Can we make bandages? I think the only way to make bandages is you have to upgrade 
Which workbench? One of these workbenches. And I don't even know how to upgrade a workbench. Yeah, like how do you even I don't I have no idea. Alright, so we can how much did that cost? How much does it cost? Uh we're fine. I have a lot. So we need to make twenty of whatever the hell I just made. Twenty woven fabric and four cotton wool, which requires cotton fiber, sweet. And boom, we can make the teddy bear, which we give to the bear because you know you wanted his teddy bear. So let's let's do that. That would be the smart thing to do. And hopefully we get some goodies from this quest. I don't know. We have to do this Erkius Crystal quest. But the thing is, I don't have armor for it. So I don't know how it's going to work out at all. I, I'm going the wrong way. Okay, I lied. I was going the right way. Hey, I got your bear. Little Dipper is happy now. Thank you. Now I can finish opening up the shop reward bag. Have I even opened a single reward bag? <laughs> how many reward bags do I have? I have dark matter or reward bags. I feel like I've been... Oh, okay, yeah, I have been getting some. How do you open it? You just... Manipulator or... Yeah, manipulator module. Mr. Crunch Poker. Who texting me right now, bro? Come on. You really texting me in the middle of recording. Um... We got this. Which does a flurry attack? Let me see. Is it right click? This, okay so with us you know helping them out we can actually buy stuff so uh let, let's do that i'm gonna sell this spear because this one sucked shit i'll sell you this one too because i like the sword i have and i'm just gonna rock with the sword that i have what is this we use upgrade ships okay so what is that want some psycho i accidentally used the psycho that was an accident uh let's buy silver bars we need five. Oh god this is gonna cost a lot 1500 is this worth because i need five right no i just need one okay which yeah just buy one that's not that bad then boom one and we can now do this quest and get our jump upgrade thank god that i didn't need to buy five so let's go ahead let's do it we're gonna do our jump training here but yeah sorry if these episodes don't come out that often uh starbound is a lot more of an open-ended game and I don't know, I feel like if I just record everything I do in Starbound, it'd be pretty boring. Because most of this episode so far, I spent mining and walking around on the planet again. So like, I don't know, I don't feel like that, that was interesting footage to watch. Ooh, look at the double jumps. Ooh, look at the double jumps. I know y'all seen them. Okay, so this one, we had to like, whoosh, ooh, I got the moves. We're going over here. Oh my God, y'all see the moves. That's it? That was it. Man, that was too easy. That was too easy. He gave me an easy course. He gotta give me a hard one. That was a little bit too easy, my guy. Open the fucking door. Who closing the door on me? All right, we're gonna get our double jump though. This is gonna be dope. But yeah, my bad if the episodes come out in like big chunks or not big chunks in uh big gaps between each episode. The tech I'm working on now is truly fantastic. It enables the user to compress into a small spherical form, ideal for moving around in tight spaces. Isn't there like a bubble gadget? I'm sorry, I just burp right there. 10 gold bars. How many gold bars do I have? Not a single one. Deep down here in the mines, I've been mining for like 20 minutes. I found another challenge room, and this time we have double jumps and stuff. So, uh, you know, high possibility in us succeeding. What the fuck is that? What is that? This Gary gone wrong, bro. Y'all know Gary from SpongeBob? Gary's a snail, right? That looks more like a slug. I mean, it had a shell and everything. Like a snail without a face? Oh, God, there's another one. Um, how do we handle this? Beat his ass. That's how we handle it. Shell? You in your shell, huh? You talking all that shit, and then you want to hop in your shell. What's up with, like, the lag on the monsters? Y'all seen that? Monsters keep, like, freezing for a second. If I die, do I go all the way back up? How does this work? I don't care. Whatever. <laughs> Let's do it. I want to beat one of these. I don't think I've ever beaten one of these. So I'm pretty hyped. Oh, God. <clears throat> Not so hyped anymore. This actually isn't that hard. I'm talking shit already. I haven't even done. <laughs> I've done like the first five seconds of it. Okay. We good. We chilling. We chilling. Oh, this is light work. What is this? How do we get past this? What is this? Is this going to freeze me? All right. Let me try something here. Uh, oh, okay. Anti-grav. I see it. 
Oh my god, I don't have the little ball thing. You know what that guy was the scientist was talking about, right? I can't I can't move forward then, can I? What? You really need all the tech to move forward? Just kill me then, motherfucker. I have the goods. We have enough gold bars. Most excellent now all that remains to test the distortion sphere. You know, it would have been nice having this when we did that challenge. Yes, sir. Let's do it. I'm ready. I don't remember how this one works. I remember when I played Starbound back when in its earlier days. Not that early, but it had its little tech shit. Press F to make the use to make use of the distortion sphere tech. Huh. <laughs> interesting, interesting. But yeah, there was like a bubble. Like a weird bubble that you used to like get around really fast and like bounce around. I think. Maybe I'm thinking of a different game, but I'm pretty sure I'm not. Oof. We're running low on energy here. Do I have to stand still for it to regen? We do, okay. But this thing's pretty useful. I can see this being useful. Ooh, look at that. Did you see that? Man, I did it before the tutorial even came up. This is pretty cool though. I like this. Oof, my boy was rolling. My boy had speed on that. Y'all know Mach 5? He he had Mach 6 on that. Alright, so now we can fully do those challenges. Finally. Because I have not been able to complete one of those. <clears throat> Excellent search for your tech perform just as I hope it would. Uh, please keep it. Thanks to, you, thanks to you. I've been able to make some infinite strides in my research. That's it. That's the last quest for him. Sweet. It's looking good. Uh, is that frog guy here? You know, I've seen him walking around here, but he just won't go to his shop. So I don't know what to say about it. Is there a way to go faster? No, okay, it's fine. Who's that? That guy looks fishy as hell. Suspicious as hell. Excuse me, sir. Can I ask you a question? The time will come for you, Budokai, but you are not ready yet. Oh, shit. That's ominous. All right, so it has been like a couple of days. I literally cannot get the amount of petals needed. So we're just gonna go straight to the quest. Hopefully it's not too tough without armor. I mean, we got a, we got a headpiece. Good enough, am I right? I've done this quest so many goddamn times, yo. But let's do it, I'm ready. Uh, I will actually attempt to snag all the loot this time. Because, uh, you know, last time it didn't really matter because last time we played, we were kind of, can I open? Oh. Last time we played, we were kind of, you know, just doing it for a little episode in the Terraria series. Which, if you haven't seen that episode, you missed out. But you can still watch it because you can literally watch it whenever the hell you want. But yeah, let's see. Let's make sure we snag everything. Nothing in here. Turn on the lights. There's a locker down here. I know there's like a. Ooh, I know there's like a space armor set. Or not armor set, but like space set that you can get here. So let's keep our eyes out for that. We gotta activate some over here. No problem, I'm on it right away. I'm on it right away. This right here, you activate this, an enemy falls down, and then it's go time. Why do enemies have lag? I will never understand this. It's a single player game. All right, let's uh, use this. Look at that, one enemy and we're almost fucking dead. So this is looking like it's gonna be good. <laughs> I mean, these fucking darts are doing work. Our weapons that we begin have been very bad. So, like, you can't even blame me if my, like, damage is ass. Very good reason why it's ass is because the game just did not want to give me goodies to work with. Just start spamming. Just spam. Ooh, I love that mob lag. It's always nice. Anything here? I don't know if any... Oh, my God. That's a lot of enemies. I don't know if anything even spawns in those crates. We'd be nice right now. These Once we run out of these darts, though. Oh, shit. It's all for one and one for all. What's that shit they're saying? Like, kid shows? All right, what about here? Loot, loot, okay, there is loot. Nice, I'll take it. No, free loot is always good loot. Free loot is always good loot in my books. It's never a bad thing to get free loot. Is this two enemies on top of it? Don't! Dude's nutting on me! Oh my God, Shane Dawson type beat. All right, hold up. Can I eat food? Oh shit, well, let me eat it. Um, It's all good. Just use a bandage up there. I didn't use a bandage, by the way. What the fuck? I, I left click too. If I died, I have made it back where I was after that bullshit of me spamming left click with the healing salve out and it just didn't heal me. It's all good. You know, I just wanted to fight a million enemies again. This is really not easy without armor. Keep your distance. What do you mean keep your distance? You fucking racist? You get him. You fight him. 
drop a weapon at least if you die. Come on, bro, it's only one enemy, man. I killed like 30. Okay, so... Okay, there's a rocket launcher. Maybe that will be helpful. I hope the fuck it is. I need some weapons, bro. I don't got no good weapons at all. Uh, where is it at? There it is. So let's see how good this rocket launcher is. What is to the left? There was like a path to go to the left. I didn't know how to open it. Whatever. Oh, shit. It does 20 a hit. Is that a lot? I have no idea. Whatever. I wonder what the right click does to this rocket launcher. Because most weapons have a right click attack. crazy ow taking stupid damage right now it's all good hit him boom boom oh shit come on charge 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 okay reach him reach him i don't know if we're gonna get this whole space suit because i don't know like the secret to get the space suit. <laughs> some of them some of the pieces are a little bit harder to get than others i already feel like we went the wrong way but, uh, i guess we'll figure out soon enough won't we i'm assuming go this way we get one of the pieces i think i don't know i'm not sure yeah this rocket launcher is gonna carry us though how did i miss i don't know i can shoot under wherever the fuck i shot under i don't care about the coins what is this okay that doesn't do anything okay i know there's some areas can't you roll into certain areas here what's down here drop down okay you can't drop down underneath that all good we're just gonna let it let it rip battle going on here let's see what we got i got goodies in here wow 15 totally worth my time boom i'll take it you know a lot of ropes and a lot of flares this is gonna help out a lot yes sir i can't get this off my screen please all right what's in here okay you got another gun it's an assault rifle not even gonna worry about it we got a rocket launcher why the fuck would i care here we go we got the helmet we got the helmet boys let's put it on boom yes sir so now we need the chest piece and the legs all right i found the next piece boom the chest plate and we also got communication failed the transcript of a failed outgoing radio message will automate lock. whatever i will just put on my armor that's or not my armor my vanity i also picked this up the high vis jacket which is, I guess, what these workers are wearing. All right, one more piece. All right, I found another crate. I read that there's like a lot more crates. Is this the pants? Okay, it is the pants. I read there's a lot of crates, unless that's like an older version, but boom, we got the whole set. We looking good. All right, let's take on the boss now. All right, so there's like this uh, secret room right here. I don't know how to get into it. I read up on it. There's like a whole like theory, theorem. No, that's the wrong word. There's a whole lot of shit with it. That's pretty much what I'm trying to say. And I have no idea how to get through that from there. All right, here we go. We get to fight this boss. Get my ass beat. This boss isn't that hard. But, like, still. We could easily die. <laughs> Which is what I want to stay away from, if possible. I'm stuck. Y'all seen that? The game is trying to rig me for an L. Just got straight up stuck. All right, go, go, go. Go, go, go. And that's a hit right there, baby. All right. Get the RPG out. Because we know from this point... Wait, isn't he supposed to spawn enemies? You know what? It's... Oh, God. Is it lagging? Is it... Okay, it's going the opposite direction. Yeah, we know he's supposed to spawn enemies at a certain point. He's going to turn it off, right? Doesn't he, like, stop at some point? Stop. 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 No. No stopping. Oh, God. Okay, there you go. And then he, like, spawns enemies down there. Oh, you can't shoot through that. You can shoot through that. And then we activate everything. Oh, fuck. I'm trying to kill the enemy. To the best of my ability, whatever enemy's down there, I'm trying to kill. I'm hitting him low key. Look, he takes a little bit of damage. <laughs> you think if you hit him enough, you make him take enough damage to where you can, like, cancel a whole phase of the fight? I don't know. It's a very high possibility. Go quick, quick, quick. Okay, down, down, down. Now we have to fucking wait. <laughs> How uh, close does this get? It's pretty damn close. But yeah, we gotta wait for him to turn off again. This boss is not hard, like, you know, mechanically wise, but it's more of the, the walk, or not the walk, the adventure to get to the boss it takes a little bit due to the fact that you know, the enemies hit a little hard. You easily die, especially to those, like, mid-tier, or not mid-tier, like, the second tier of the enemies. The ones with the hammers, those guys hit really hard. But, you know, when you pick up an RPG, life is a lot easier. 
Shout out to this RPG for carrying me. You saved me. I thought I was done for when that thing captured me. You're my hero. I guess I better start fixing up the mine. You better give me that suck suck if you know what I'm saying. Yeah, let's go ahead. Let's achieve, achieve, retrieve our reward. Ooh, we got some goodies. Diamonds. Whatever the fuck that is. These look like some goodies, man. I'm taking these. We're out of here. We finally got the crystals. We can repair our ship. We can play the fucking game. I'm hyped. Maybe I'll get some armor eventually. All right, hello, sir. I have the stuff for my ship. Perfect. These will do the job. I'll go ahead and fix your ship right now. Thank you. Repairing an FTL drive. Is he missing a leg? He got really good. Oh, they knocked his ass over. I was about to say, he has really good balance for only having one leg, but then he got his shit rocked. <laughs> but uh, there you go. It has been done. Is that a vehicle? Can I buy that? What the hell? Friendly, I'm an inventor. Do you also like to create things? Yes. Do, ooh. Crucial component of vehicle repair. What the hell? This is where you buy mechs? Oh my god. I'm pretty hyped. What did you say? I don't know. Oops. I hope that doesn't hit anyone. But there you go. That has been completed. Is there anyone else that gives quests here? I don't think so. I don't think, I don't think so yet. Wait, what does it say? Is my ship completed? I don't know. I wasn't paying attention at all. But, uh, let's head back to our ship, I guess. Make sure everything's completed. Because I'm trying to end this episode off. I think it is. Right? Trip tests are online. FTL drives online. Ship teleportation system functioning correctly. The entire universe is accessible. Let's go. Let's open up this bag, though, before we go. Wow. Awesome.